Hey, what is going on guys? So I got a really nice review today for a car mount by Best Tricks. Now let me go ahead and show you how this car mount works. Now I have a lot of other car mounts and this one is definitely different from all of them. Now what I'm gonna do is hook up several different phones to this. And let me go ahead and detach this first here so I can give you like a better look. And I'll tell you in one second why this is different than all the other car mounts that I have. But you can see how this one looks here. And you have this swivel base down here. This swivel is 360 degrees, as you can see here. You also have this arm here. You can adjust upwards and downwards, all the way up like that. As the furthest that it will go up, this is the furthest that it's gonna go down, just like this. And of course you have a lock here for the suction cup here. Now what is great about this car mount here, if you guys are familiar with any of the car mounts, you know, you typically have ones that are stuck to the vent here. The only thing is, when you have car mounts that are stuck to the vent, when you have your phone on there, it's actually blocking out the air. And some other car mounts, you can actually go ahead and suck it to your dashboard like this. The only thing is the other ones, the phone is not gonna go all the way down here. It's gonna go up here, so this will kind of block the view. Same thing if you have a suction cup car mount holder on your windshield. When you put it on there, it will kind of block your view looking straight out. Now, of course, this right here is a magnet. And what this comes with here is you basically get this in the box, this whole thing here, and you also get like two magnets. So you get two different size magnets here. It's up to you which one you wanna use. I'm gonna go ahead and use this one. Now, the thing is, it has like tape on the back here. So what you can do is actually you can go ahead and get your phone and you can stick it right on here. Or another thing you can do is you can just go ahead and not stick it. You can leave it like that. And here's a regular rubber TPU case here. You can just simply go ahead and put this case on top just like this and it's going to stick on there fine. Or what else you can do if you wanted to, you can go ahead and stick the magnet onto the outer case just like that as well. I'm going to go ahead and just leave it in here just like this. Go ahead and put my case on. And then let me go ahead and clamp this back down here and again I'll go ahead and show you this arm here it goes all the way up right here and it'll go all the way down here and again you have this swivel here as well let me go ahead and lock this arm I like to have mine like right about here and again you can see the magnet part right here so I can just go ahead and grab my phone I can pop it on just like that and you can go ahead and swivel that around you can even rotate this 360 degrees you can pull it off you can put it back on like this if you wish now, another thing I want to know too, if you guys have like a Android phone, like a Samsung Galaxy S6 and above, these phones already have some kind of magnet back here. So you don't even have to use one of these magnets if you're using one of these Samsung Galaxy phones naked because you can just pop it on there just like that. Also, of course, if you guys have a bigger phone, like a iPhone Plus, this is a 6S Plus here. I have a different magnet on here from a different car mount that I had, but this one works fine too. Even bigger phones will work on this as well. No problem here. And what I could actually do too is when I first got this, what I was doing was I was putting it over here, but then I realized it was, it was just a better position for me to put it over here, but I'll put it over here. I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like over here. So what I could do is I can go ahead and just put it on here on top of this part of my dash here, hold this down, clamp that down. And then I can go ahead and put my phone here. And this is fine too, because it's not actually like right on the vent. I'm still giving it room directly from my vent to my phone, you can kind of see. And I'll give you a view of the other side as well. So just to give you a better look, you can see my vents right here, but my phone is up here. And of course I can go ahead, see this isn't tight, I can go ahead and tighten this up just like that and bam, I'm ready to rock and roll. And I can go ahead and tilt this any position, any way that I want. Well, there you guys go. Pretty simple review. Guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.